everybody, it's PJ and I'm here to give you ideas for what to give your other half for Valentine's Day. If your man or woman is an Aries, um, it, Aries rules the head and face. So facials, head massages, a uh, trip to the hair salon, because I'm an Aries. Do you get it? See this? See? See? People are saying, how about a little fire, scarecrow? Yeah. So hair salon, barber, red is their color. So red candles, red lingerie, lots of sex toys. They love, sex is like exercise. Um, exercise equipment, um, like, uh, Exercise clothing, that kind of thing. Um, if you're going to take them out to dinner, how about an open grill restaurant or like a spicy restaurant? Um, you can get salsa lessons, karate lessons for two, um, do any kind of workout lessons for two, a rock climbing. They're very energetic, so you have to take up that energy. Hiking, campfires outdoor, if you want to give them candy, hot pepper candy, uh, it's like the hot pepper chocolate, or the cinnamon chocolate, both of which are like spicy, you can use either one of those. Um, get them red roses uh, with thorns, because they're edgy, and the card that comes is plenty. You don't have to get them anything but the little card that comes in the box and say, or with the roses and say what you mean. Taurus. Tauruses are soft and it rules the neck and throat. So, um, scarves, sh shoulder, shoulder massage, anything with the neck and throat. Um, cashmere scarves, uh, sweaters, um, any kind of thing that goes around their neck is lovely. Um, they also like peace. So, CDs of the ocean waves or ethereal music like Enya, that kind of thing. Um, okay, lingerie, pink or white. Peach is also a good color for them. Candles in the same colors. Um, you can take them out. You know, they're cows. Um, they're the bull, so they're cows. And so they love, usually, they love dairy. So, fondue restaurants. Um... Uh, get them and they love being by the water too even though they're not a water sign they're an earth sign they love to be by the water so uh, a restaurant by the water is wonderful for them soft romantic music floral perfume or good cologne rich uh, the only sex toy you'll need with the Taurus is your own skin and a feather take a look yeah um, okay so then we have roses of any color but red, no thorns, and a romantic card. Gemini. Geminis are your butterfly, and it rules the nervous system. Gener like that. When I say it rules something, it means that's the most Im the part of the body the sign rules. So Gemini nervous system. So you want to get them things that will help them sleep and are soothing, like an aromatic bubble bath or. Um, uh, even candles that are aromatherapy, calm down candles, uh, chamomile tea, but you don't want to quell that energy because that's what makes them so fun. The, uh, Geminis are just fun people. I've got one that I've worked with forever. Hey, Jen. And she is the most fun ever. Um, sexy photographs. They'll either take them or enjoy them. Either way. Um, baby doll pajama or like baby doll little lingerie sets. Blue candles, because they're babyish, kind of, or childlike. They're so fun. Blue candles, sparkly lingerie. Um, also, you can, if you want to take them somewhere, take them on a, a balloon ride at, like, the sunset, one of those hot air balloons. They would love that. Um, you could take them to dinner somewhere they've never been, something new. Uh, you could take them to the zoo, the circus. They would love the circus, a little cirque. Um, an aquarium. Books like that have haikus in them, but not like dead poetry, like a lot of a heavy poetry book because they don't have the patience, truthfully. Um, bound journals, they like to write. Um, you can give them a m box of like mixed cream chocolates, like different uh, middles in them. Um, lilac powder or oils is good for them too. It's soothing. Um, earrings or crystal earrings, anything bitters too. So two earrings, earrings, cufflinks. Um, you can have them of crystals, white, sapphires, 
and I would get them a hanging plant, like a fern, because they're an air sign, and ferns are very airy, and um, a really fun card, okay? Okay, now we're up to Cancer. I have Cancer children. They'll love this. Um, anyway, um, with a Cancer, you can get them a beautiful blouse, a shirt, a sweater. A Cancer's rule, mammaries, the boobs, okay? And motherhood and lots of other homey kind of things, but boobs. So if you have a Cancer man, he likes boobs, <laughs> just so you know. Anyway, um, a beautiful blouse, shirts, if he's a Cancer, shirts, sweaters, even used stuff. They love antiques and things that are used. Candles of black and white lingerie in black or white. Um, sexy bras and panties. A wicker baskets. Antique shopping. Like go shopping together at an antique store. Curiosity store. Um, bathtub sex would be really fun for a little cancer in the water. Um, okay. Old books. Poems read out loud. They love to read to their other uh, have pillow sheets maybe silk or Egyptian cotton um, after dinner drinks if you're gonna you know you can take them out or you can give them a home-cooked meal so I I would give them a home-cooked gourmet meal um, laying in front of the fire afterwards reading the new used poetry book would be a lovely night for them and um, sea spray for in between the sheets hemp jewelry they love hemp um, Silver, of course, you know, it's the moon ruled. So it's silver and moonstone is their stone and pearl. A single white rose. Um, and you can give them a handwritten card or um, even like a poem or uh, a song that you wrote yourself. Okay, and we're on to Leo. Leo uh, rules the heart. So it's a back massage, a chest massage, a full day at the spa for two. They are the rulers of the galaxy. They love to be treated like the kings and queens that they are. Um, a limo ride, uh, champagne, gold candles, luxe perfume, luxe, luxe, luxe cologne, trips to Vegas. They are gamers. They love to play games. So video games, um, casinos, uh, take them out to a late night dinner. Um, ballroom dancing is ruled by Leo, which I was amazed to find that out. I even learn, learn something new every day, but you can give them ballroom dancing lessons or go ballroom dancing a weekend. Like I said, at the casino, a heart charm, um, a heart bracelet, um, all, everything gold. They love gold, and it's gold chains, gold watches, cufflinks, money clips. Money clips a good gift. Wallets or purses, and uh, their sex toy would be like sexual favors, like giving back and forth. Um, <laughs> TMI, I don't know. Amber colored roses or yellow roses, um, an inscribed note or like um, an embossed kind of card, like something a little high end. That is Leo. On with Virgo. Virgo uh, is ruled by its bowels, the belly, and um, also it rules fear. So put those two together and you have somebody who cares about what they put in their, their stomach. So I would go to a organic restaurant or um, a sustained restaurant, you know, those self-sustaining restaurants. Um, Artisan beer would be a great gift or going to a brewery for dinner where you can see where the beer's made. Cooking lessons together. Um, hor anything horticultural wise, like with the earth, they work very well. They are an earth sign and they work good with the earth. Um, a spa with mineral baths or mud baths. Um, green candles, earthy scents, lace for the lingerie. Would also do, they. their stone is red, brown and moss agate and uh, jasper and it goes in platinum watches but the one thing I came up with I thought that was cool was a spoon ring because they're all about you know their bellies um, flowers or wildflowers a mix of wildflowers and a romantic card Libras now Libras care like they they see each other they're partnerships. That's what they are. So they see each other the way somebody else sees them. So a full body massage, high-end clothes, designer clothes, you know, labels, 
Um, Candles in off-white, light blue, or light pink. Uh, everything's very soft. You know, Libras are very, um, uh, it rules the skin. So they have very sensitive skin. So any kind of lotions and whatnot, you know, as long as it's like really healing or helpful lotions for them would be great. Mm. Professional portraits, silver frames for, for, for uh, pictures. Uh, cologne, new perfume, gold watches and rings. Again, we're at gold. They are the ones that want you to ask them to marry them on Valentine's Day, by the way. Opals, sapphires, um, large, biggest box of candy you can get in the drugstore. Big, big hard candy. And, um, send flowers. Don't bring them because they want to see all their girlfriends at work. They want them to be jealous and see exactly how much uh, they mean to their uh, boyfriend or husband. So one dozen long stem roses, in, uh, again, in pink or off-white, no thorns, and a large card. Now, Scorpio. And I was married to one of these guys. So when I wrote this, I was like, yeah. But um, my first husband um okay so scorpios find a spa where you can lock the door and they have them they had them on the cruise ship that i was on with my actually with my boyfriend but they had them where you could lock the door and just rent the spa for the day where you lock the door and nobody's there so, go shopping together for sex toys okay because they love the shopping itself is what's the big deal um high heels handcuffs um yeah Red lingerie, black lingerie, voodoo dolls, spells, like get them a cutesy little spell. Uh, it, they're ruled by the genitalia. Yeah, so fun. Leather pants, any kind of pants, but leather pants are probably the the most fun ones. Belts, um, rock concert tickets, boxing tickets, um, gift cards for boots, shoes, that kind of thing. Anything from the waist down. Uh, sexy under, I would say to you, sexy undies, but what I would say to you most is like, if you want to know what kind of candy they want for Valentine's, probably edible can, edible panties. Yeah. So that would be their favorite candy. <laughs> anyway, um, rings of black onyx and opal, um, symbolic jewelry. They don't always like have like when they write out a card they might not say love at the bottom. my ex-husband used to write wild horses for the rolling stones song instead of saying i love you he would say wild horses so very symbolic people so if you have symbols that's why you can get like tattoos together for valentine's day that is even something the uh flowers i would get them a live plant of succulents cactus um, a simple, straightforward card that says what you wanted to say, but then symbols at the end. Um, surprise plane tickets are for your Sagittarius because they are the runners. They love to journey. They're the journeymen. Plane tickets to a spa, resort, health weekend, couples retreat, anything like that where they don't even know where they're going. You blindfold them. They like that stuff. Indigo is their color, so indigo candles. It's like a deep purple. Um, luggage is a great, great gift for them. Artwork from another country. They're very, anything multicultural, they're going to enjoy. Dinner, multicultural restaurant, that kind of thing. Um, they're also super adventurous, so skydiving, bungee jumping, um, explore, anything new. Dogs ra dog races, horse races, casinos, because they're very lucky. Green spees, sunglasses, a cool pair of sunglasses, gold, it, it's gold is the metal, bracelets, rings, blue topaz is the stone, um, and citron, multicolored carnations for their flowers, and a funny card, because they're just funny people. Okay, on to Capricorn. Capricorns are a little stoic, a little shy, so um, they tend to have... It's the bones, uh, what rules them are the bones in their body. So I would say a deep tissue massage to get right down in there. Now, gray or silver is their color. Candles, dresses, ties, jackets. They tend to have conventional jobs, so suit type things. Um, things for a desk, a silver mail opener, family photos, family seal or crest. Ceramic, it rules the kilns and 
all that. So uh, ceramic lessons, yoga lessons, Tai Chi, chess sets, retro video games. They love history or anything old. Um, dinner at a local restaurant or a historic restaurant. Picnics in a picnic blast basket. Watching the stars is something they would love because that's the oldest history. Museums. Seeing local talent, karaoke's, that kind of thing. Survival manual manuals. Uh, zombie survival manuals would actually go to a Capricorn. Um, the pedometer to track their steps. Books on decorating or woodwork. Isn't that interesting? Um, their colors uh, for jewelry, or I'm sorry, their stones are jade. Garnet, ruby, agate, and it's all wrapped in silver. Um, and you would want to get them truffles as a candy. Aquarius rules electricity and the future. And so you have all the electrical impulses in your body. It also rules the liver and whatnot. But that electrical impulse through your body, I thought it would be best to go with acupuncture or acupressure time like you can buy them time um chiropractor time or reiki get them reiki done um candles of royal blue indigo or violet um a pedicure where the, your calves are also massaged um sports tickets because the thing about aquarius is, is they like lots of people so sporting events is fabulous so sports tickets any kind of show tickets um they like collectibles from those things um, you can buy them iPads and uh, iPods and new gaming videos, um, a laptop, that kind of thing, remote control toys. Um, and again, any kind of sex toy would have to be a vibrator, okay? Um, you would take them to a sports bar for dinner and let with all his friends. And then afterwards, you know, then you'll have your alone time. You would give him chocolate or her chocolate covered nuts as their candy. Um, I would give them a live plant, like a bonsai, so they can nurture it because they are like the humanitarians. And a small card that was very funny because they're funny guys and girls. Their stones are opal and garnet and amethyst. And I'll tell you what though, I wouldn't use the amethyst because the big thing about amethyst is it cools the passion. So I have a spell one day I'm gonna do for you guys that like if somebody's mad at you to get them not to be mad at you and you use amethyst, amethyst in it. So don't use that. Last but not least is Pisces. We're at the end, yay. Okay, so Pisces is the hands and feet. I would have a tickle fest with them, give them tons of hugs, a foot and hand massage, um, seafood restaurants, manicure, pedicure, again, hands and feet, slippers, gloves, um, um, anything made of driftwood, um, sea trinkets, sea turtles, uh, ocean kind of animals uh, and charms and whatnot. Perfect or in trinkets or tchotchkes. So a great dream book or a dream catcher is fabulous. Um, clear, any kind of clear liquor is fabulous. Uh, running shoes, raincoats, rain boots, um, any kind of foot scrub. So that all works. Their stones are crystals, amethysts. Again, I would not use that. And aquamarine. And you can buy them toe rings. You can buy them ankle bracelets, like that kind of thing. Okay, and their candy would be rock candy. Their card would be serious. And the night would be romantic because these guys, and let me tell you what, Pisces would be the only one I'd say, yeah, get them a kitten or puppy. Like none of the other signs without asking what I suggest you do that. But a Pisces would just say, oh, because that's the kind of guys and girls they are. They love little creatures. So that's the Zodiac and all the gifties you can possibly get. I'm going to link below the link to a store I found online that I think is fabulous. It has this plus more and uh, go through it and see if you find something. Comment down below and let me know what you bought your other half, okay, for Valentine, what you got them for Valentine's Day. If you would like to jump down the rabbit hole that is my life and follow me, Go ahead and hit the button below and subscribe. Um, I love you guys all. The magic's in you. I'll see you tonight. We're going to do a wicked, wicked 
um, fire spell for love. You'll see.